this is missing Lanika Smith. She's 19 years old. She's 6'3", 250 pounds. She was the last seen 11-26-2022, leaving Shelbyville Taco Bell drive through at 1.46 a.m., headed north on Highway 231 towards uh, Merrill Freesboro in her champagne silver 2002 Nissan Pathfinder. Okay, anybody with info? Call this number three or nine three one six eight four three two three two. Okay, here's her vehicle, and I got a video here of her dad. I don't know who he is, but he seems to be somebody um, like popular in Tennessee. Also, social media could be the devil's playground. And shame on you all for people telling her dad that nobody will snatch her up. Okay because of how she looks, which is BS. Um, let's see, also, her phone um, is shut off. Um, if I can think of anything, I'll come back to you guys. And also, I wanna say, she's from Tennessee, by the way. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I noticed that she changes her hair color. I've seen it three different colors, okay? Okay, here's a plate number of her vehicle, BCD8781, and this is her dad, the real big Mo. So if you want to check out his page on Facebook. So an update on today's situation, as all of you are aware, I asked for your help earlier, help find my daughter Lanika, because as of last night around 1 a.m. was the last time she was seen and we don't know where she's at right now. Uh, we've ruled out the Winchester information. I went over and talked to everyone that was involved with that. Um, she was not in Winchester last night. She was in Winchester Wednesday night. So we're back in <coughs> Bedford County and have issued a missing persons report with the Shelbyville Police Department. So. Um, if anybody knows the whereabouts of my youngest daughter, Lanika Smith, uh, she drives a 2002 Nissan Pathfinder that's kind of a pewter gray, uh, six foot three, 250 pounds, blonde hair, glasses. I'll post a picture of her in the comments. Um, I appreciate everybody that's reached out and helped. Uh, I deleted the earlier post because I don't want anybody thinking that she is where we thought she was first. So I've ruled out the Winchester area as of uh, this afternoon, but we still have not found her. She was last seen around one, between one and 2 a.m. this morning, headed north on 231. Uh, if anybody knows where she is or if anybody knows how to get in touch with her um please let us know her cell phone is turned off or it's dead uh her car is not here she's in her car um her roommates don't know where she's at and none of her family is where where she's at i'm here with her roommates and her sister and her stepmother and myself and we have a lot of people that are looking for her and if anybody knows anything on where Lanika Smith is, please let us know and uh, greatly appreciate it. But we've ruled out the Winchester area and now we're back in Bedford County trying to figure out where she could be here. Um, and we're just going to continue to look and I'll keep you updated. And sorry to have to reach out to y'all for this, but this is how you get the word out. And I really need everybody's help finding my daughter. So I appreciate it. Um, I'm going to post a picture of her in the comments. And uh, then you can go from there. So thank you for your help. And I'll keep you updated. Appreciate it. Am I going to be single for the rest of November? Am I going to be single in December? Am I going to get a boyfriend by college graduation?